Hello folks, as we approach the final game of the season, it's almost that time for the last matchup of the regular season before heading off to a postseason, the wild card and the Stanley Cup playoffs, including the finals. We have the last matchup here as we are about to see Chicago Blackhawks and the Vegas Golden Knights. Golden Knights in the in the uh, postseason so far, they are on the roll. We haven't seen the Golden Knights winning the Stanley Cup every year. After 2018, they made it all the way to the Stanley Cup Finals, but they lost against the Capitals in Game Five. It was a very tough matchup in between the range, but not even to convince how well they played. It's how hard they have done. So, will the Golden Knights try to answer back and go back to the Stanley Cup and take it all the way to the finals? Find out in the postseason of the Stanley Cup playoffs after the regular season. Here are the lineups as we see Patrick Kane, Mark andre Fleury, which have been playing here with the Golden Knights, but unfortunately his year of his Golden Knights is turning to be it for the end of era for the Knights, but still playing, but he's now on a different team. And Alec Dubrancat. And on the other side, Jack Icho, Alex Pietrangelo, and Mark Stone. A lot too much hard has happening going on, but we might be seeing some best players on offense and defense. Another rivaling in the matchup, Marc-Andre Fleury on fire. Watch out for him because everybody was going to be complete shock of his goalie defending save. So let's head you over to T-Mobile Arena for the last game. Guys? Everybody, I'm James Polsky along with Ray Ferraro here for this NHL Western Conference matchup tonight. Centers are lined up, official ready to drop the puck. This is it, last game of the season. Let's finish it all. The Blackhawks take possession here on the opening draw and we are underway. Oh, we got a piece of it to keep it out. Sends a pass over. Vegas has it against the half wall. Moves it quickly over to Petrangelo. Let's it rip. Makes the save. Cool and calm under pressure. And remember, watch out for Flurry. He's got a great defense. Great Don't let this happen again. By deking him out with his puck on a string zone ability. Eichel's make it snappy zone ability helps him score when he shoots while in motion, making it so hard to catch up to the release. I'm expecting one of these players to make a big difference for their team before the game is over. Back to you guys. Turns it aside with the glove. Slides the puck over. Chicago's got possession of the puck. And they'll go the other way with a great play by Dedanov. Ooh, try the backhand, but it didn't work. From the back of the cage. From the opposite point. Puck grab by Eichel. And now he angles it across to Martinez. Puck picked up by Strom. Tried to get 2 Q with it and loses possession. Along the right side into the offensive zone. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Taken by Kubelik. Into the offensive zone. Takes a wrist shot. Scores! Oh, what a finish! On wow, it. what a high man rush with a reach. When they can pull this move on in so tight, what a great play! And he finishes it by beating the goaltender. It's tough to keep an eye on his quick hands when Chicago goal. His first goal of the season, so scored by number eight, Patrick Kane. Really his first assist here by. And get a K, and by Pumpkin. Right, Time of the goal, two minutes and 85 seconds. One nothing in the score, Chicago. One shot on goal. Four shots on goal, and two for Golden Knights. Quick 
stops, keep the puck out. Oh, that's going to be a penalty on this play here, James. Quick feed to Taze. We got a whistle, penalty coming up. Biggest penalty, William Grossing. Two minutes for interference. Penalty kill. And the Vegas. power play unit takes to the ice their first chance to try to make something happen in this game. You want to win the special teams battle almost every night. Well, the power play's first chance to check in here. We'll see what they can get done. And they clear that puck. Takes the pass. The Golden Knights get a hold of the puck under man. Petrangelo's taking it from his own end. Sends it in on the attack. Chicago's got the puck behind the net. Strom's got it across the line. That's blocked by Leonard. Petrangelo's moving the puck through his own zone. And his stick, his stick flies across. And he has to get another stick. Stevenson's last stick's in the garbage dump. He had to go get a new one. And yep, always got to get a new one. Chicago's got control of it now from their own end. Enters the offensive zone from the left. This one comes up with a monster save in front. Yeah, he got out tight to him, James. There's nowhere for that puck to go. Vegas on the attack. Carlson Sopkin ready to join the play. Great reach by Stevenson. The Blackhawks moving it. And that's it. Strains it up, and we are all even up. What possession along the wall? Here's a chance. Angles it over to Carlson. And here at center, that's intercepted. Right in front of the net. Makes the save. And there's another stop. Sometimes you're in close, there's no room to put it anywhere. The goalie smothered it all. Who's the puck? They gain the offensive zone from the middle. Here's the pass down low. And they lost the puck. They're going to have to start all over again. Pushes it across to Petrangelo. Here they come on the attack. The Blackhawks take possession of the defensive end. And just like that, from out of nowhere... Nope, nothing happened. Snaps it on net. Oh, what a stop on the play. Gets all of it with the paddle. Uh, he's going to feel he missed one there. You don't get many chances that clean. The goalie turns it aside. The Golden Knights looking against the half wall. Quick pass to Smith. Quick snap. Great save from in tight. Oh, he reads the play really well to get out and aggressive to make that save. Still lots of time left in the period. The Blackhawks lead it 1 0. Chicago's won the draw. Vegas takes possession along the wall. Tries again. Golden Knights play the puck from the back of the net. Quick feed down low. They fight for it along the boards. And a heads up kick pass over to his teammate. Chicago's got a hold of the puck. Sends it over to Jones. From the left side, they gain the zone. Chicago's got the puck in their own end. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. And now he tries to get it across to Jones. Takes a hit on the play. And too much traffic in front blocks that one. Houghton's lugging the puck. Poked away at center by Jones. Gains the zone from the right. Boom! Knocked it down. McNabb's looking around for somebody to fight. He's going to have to go and fill the dance card somewhere else. Here we go. Up and rush here. Yep. And we have a man down. You see one of uh, Ducks and Hurricanes, but Brennan Hagel is down. Went hard on the board. Hagel's being helped down the tunnel towards the locker room. He took a heavy hit. 
and will be evaluated by the training staff and doctors in the locker room. Let's see if we can try to get an update as soon as possible for you here. Yeah, we'll keep you guys on the update, so we'll let you guys know. Coglin's got the puck. Back at the point, they set it up. Denies him with the pad. And he elects to play the puck. Nice zone entry on the left side. Scrum along the boards, they battle for the puck. Taken by Lafferty. No room for that one to get through. Puck scooped up by Lafferty. Coming to the slot. Poked away in the defensive end. Down the right side and into the zone. Takes a shot. Oh, how did he get a glove on that? What a stop by Fleury. If you're tuning into March Madness, Head right down to the uh, to your TV or download the app now. Download the March Madness app and you can catch on your winning of your games to keep your scores running. Tries to get the puck to Carpenter. Takes the feed. Handles it along the blue line. Here he is, wrestled on net. Big time stop. Leonard's able to make an outstanding save. His quickness and position and give him the chance. He even get a piece of this. Play blown dead. Let's get the call. Vegas penalty. Shay Trigor. Two minutes for interference. The killers do the job. Down a goal. If they kill this, you're going to have some jump. This will be power play on Chicago. The Blackhawks send their man advantage in and out once more. Just because the power play hasn't had a success run here, you can't focus in on that. You can't try to do too much. Move the puck the way that you practice. Get people to the front of the net. It's really a simple equation. Looks a little uncomfortable like he's banged up a bit, James, but not going to the bench. Going to try and finish this shift. Trey Green with the stick. The Blackhawks gain possession along the wall. Coming down the left wing and into the zone. And he's able to handle that one. Scores! They deliver big time on the man advantage. Yeah, they use that extra man to their advantage. Move the puck very quickly. That's a nice goal. He made a great move to get in and score there, guys. That's his puck on a string zone ability. And it's just so entertaining to watch. And they take Chicago the goal. Nice his second goal of the season the scored on the power play. Number 88, Patrick Kane. Uh, time of the goal. Time to go, 6.35 remaining in first period, 2 nothing. Solid body check on the play. Chicago gained possession along the boards. Nice zone entry from the middle. And he regains control of the puck. Can't get it to go. He'll keep it alive and moves it ahead. The Golden Knights take it across the line. Takes the feet at the back end. Moves the puck along the half wall. Scores! They came, they saw, they took advantage of the rebound and score. Our uh, goalie burps up this rebound here. It comes right back into the shooting area and the rebound is put away. Late goings of this period. Vegas still needs one more goal in order to even things up. Score! Knight scores! Here's first goal of the season! Score by number 18, Kyle Knuckle! The Golden Knights have it now! His first assist here by number 3, on Colton! And number 71, Kyle Carlson! Time of the goal, 3.43 remaining, 2-1, and it's in first. 16 shots for Vegas, and, and 18 for Chicago. Officials are in position, and both teams are getting ready as they get set for another face-off here. The Blackhawks win the draw. Lafferty's got the puck along the wing. Vegas has possession of it now. Through center. Vegas plays along the wing. 
Oh no, not good at all. From the place 99 made famous, he was right there and they can't convert. Stevenson's got it in the offensive zone. Chicago's got a hold of the puck now. Moves it quickly over to Carpenter. Chicago's got the puck against the half wall. Dismiss that chance, and they'll cover it up, forcing a stoppage in play. Chicago started in the offensive zone. Let's let go. That was on the play. Vegas looks to break out in their own end. Picking up steam in the offensive zone. Oh, to Bison with the paddle save! Vegas plays it against the boards. Houghton's going to play it to the corner. First period nearly in the book. One more period to go! Gains the zone through center. And that's a great hands up in the defensive zone to force the turnover. Houghton's going to play it against the half wall. And we'll get a face off after the offside call. Here in the late goings of the period, the Blackhawks lead it 2-1 in what has been an entertaining game thus far. Chicago's got a hold of the puck off the draw. The Blackhawks carry it along the wall. Vegas gets a hold of the puck against the boards. And that pass can't connect. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Quick feed to Lafferty. And with that, the first period is in the books. Both teams with a chance of a refresh. We'll get a clean sheet of ice and come back with period number two. First period's over. A little bit of a contested matchup here in between uh, Chicago and Vegas. But we'll be back with the second period. Second period, ready to go. Well, after an intriguing opening period, here we go. It's period number two. Puck is dropped, and we are underway. Ray, what's your assessment of the game at this point? The Golden Knights probably a little bit unlucky in that initial frame. They controlled most of the possession, but they trailed by a goal. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Here's a shot. Clock save. Flurry's going to hang on. Song stoppage of play. It's a good thing he does because you haven't mentioned his name and I don't know how long the play's been at the other end of the ice forever. Lots of time left in this period. Chicago's up 2-1 and the crowd has been enjoying this one. And now it's over to Kane. Puck grab by Strom. Good defensive stop on the poke check. Couldn't complete the pass. Made the stop on the play. Excellent chance, they work the puck into position and it's a scoring chance, it's turned away. Chicago's got the puck. Great reach with the stick by Eichel. Chicago's got the puck. Slides it to Kubelik. Puck picked up by Martinez. Moves it to Pacioretty. Into the corner now. Can't get a hold of that pass. From the point, looks to make something happen. And that's a great defensive heads up to force the turnover. The Blackhawks move it ahead. And a puck check knocks the puck away. Eichel stick handling in his own zone. On the attack along the boards. And that's deflected. Moved up ahead here in the neutral zone. And that's stopped away by McNabb. And it's kicked away. The Golden Knights take it along the wing. Reads it perfectly and comes up with the takeaway. Theodore's got it on the offensive end. On the attack along the boards. And that's broken up in the defensive zone by Taves. Slides it over to Theodore. Gains the zone through the middle. 
dishes it to Theodore. Takes the puck at the point. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Off target. Now tough to generate a rebound even when the puck misses the net by that much. Quick pass to McNabb. From the right side, they gain the zone. Blistering shot. Oh, what a stop by Fleury. Chance in front. Oh, what another big stop. Quick reflexes and good positioning to make a couple of stops in a row. Chicago's got the puck against the boards. And the traffic neutralizes that threat. The Blackhawks gain control of it. Here's a short pass to Carpenter. Nice pass. Moves it quickly over to Kara. Great hits up play with the stick by Patrick. Can't connect on the pass. Watson the offside. Slides the puck into the offensive zone. Vegas stands a hold of possession. The Blackhawks can Didn't still the get there. The Sends it in deep. Vegas gets the puck near the boards. Chicago's got possession here in the offensive zone. And we'll hold the puck here. Everyone a chance to breathe and hang on to the puck. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame, we've got a 2-1 game. The Blackhawks take possession off the faceoff. Can't finish! Oh, Ray, blown opportunity! It really is. I mean, the play is sitting right there. There's a scoring chance to be had. They just don't execute it. Takes the feed. Oh, he's going to get called on that slash. Handles the puck. From center, they get into the attacking area. Here comes and the penalty is well, occurred on Vegas. Penalty on Vegas penalty, Brad Howden. Two minutes for interference. For slashing. Power play for Chicago. Here, guys. One way he can do that is by using his zone ability to get them going. Let's see how it goes here. Taves has won the draw. Gobbles the puck up there with a the chest. Trying to clear the zone. They try to get it off the glass with no luck. Uh, the glass is 10 feet high, James. Shoot it off the top of it and get it down the ice. Quick shot. Oh, and it's a nut. Wait, they're signaling a goal. We got to look at that one again. That play was just no luck. It was off out of reach. The Blackhawks have gone up by two here in this let's, let's have a look at the replay. Just a quick moment here before we get back into the game. Here's what just happened. It just tipped. Watch here. And you see Jones, slap shot, and then with the bang, it went right and over, up and over the blue. But he didn't save at that point. He went whiffed, and he didn't have a, have a chance. So that was definitely a tough shot. It went right off his shoulder pad, or the back of his helmet, and then it went in. It tipped right in there, just like that. I am definitely stunned of what had just happened. I'm just stunned, you know? That was like the biggest, biggest failures that I have never seen it before since um, Mark Fleury just made an outstanding performance instead of this one. Wow. I can't believe it. That was just unbelievable play. Chicago goal. His first goal of the season scored by number, number eight, number four, Solomon Jones. Time of the goals, 11 to 18 to go in the third second. in here, James. He makes the two stops back to back. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. Chicago's been the better team here over the last few minutes, increasing their lead to two. And a solid job tying up his opponent. And now it's grabbed by Strom. The Golden Knights gain possession in their own end. Knocked it. All done. 
poked away by Kubalik. The Golden Knights move to the offensive zone. Takes the feed in the middle of the ice. The Golden Knights take possession of the neutral zone. Kane's got it behind the cage. Orkstrom's got the puck in his own zone. Moves it around along the half wall. Takes that pass back at the point. Denies him! He got all of it! Dodonov's got it along the boards. Oh, look at this chance! Looks like we got a... And penalty on Chicago. That's a pretty simple call to make for... Chicago penalty, Sam Lafferty. Two minutes for roughing. Two minutes for charging. This sold out in two play. minutes. The power play, guys are power play here. for the Vegas. Here's their first. Chicago's got possession here in their own end. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Marchessault's got it along the wing. Moves it to Smith. Let's it go. Answers the call big time. What a stop by Flurry. Smothered that in for camp. And he's going to leave the net to play the puck here. Feeds it over to Marchessault. Across the line and on the attack. Trying to exit the defensive zone. And they get it down. And good communication. They talk to each other. They're in the right spot. They just clear it down the ice. Oh, bad selection pass. Into the offensive end now. From the slot, fires away. Makes it look easy with the stop. Flurry's goaltending at one end and the offensive over at the other was made for a good night. Looking to get it out. And it's a small victory for the PK unit here. Well, it's their job. Get it down the ice. Get off the ice. Get some new people out there. The Golden Knights fire blanks on the power play. We're back to even strength here. Always frustrating for the power That was a lot of frustrations. They are getting it better. And that's Offside, Vegas. Vegas. Coming up. Past the midway mark of the frame, Chicago's got a 3-1 lead. Off the draw, and a nice job locking up his opponent. Lafferty's got it into offensive territory. Picked off. Chicago's ready to go on the attack. Textbook poke check by Patrick. Moves the puck into the attacking area. Big save by the goaltender. Oh, what another save. No, sir. Gonna have to work a lot harder. Wow, Mark Fleury in pursuit. Tries to get it to Howden. And puts the puck Patrick in the bumper car hockey. The Golden Knights play the long way. Just a simple save by Fleury. And there's the whistle as he elects to slow things down a little. A pretty good decision here with the play starting to break down in front of him. And both centers glide into the dot as a face-off set to resume. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. The Blackhawks take it across the blue line. They're going to win here. Hard work is a skill, otherwise I mean, everybody else would do Oh, it's bad timing. To keep this play alive. And a puck leaves the zone, they'll be forced to revoke that center. Easily turned aside by Flurry. Moves the puck behind the net. Boom, out of here. Vegas has it near the wall. Puts it to the front of the net. Can't capitalize on the play. There's a short pass to Kane. Sends the pass over. Here's a chance on the attack. Here's a chance. How did he stop that one? Kane's eyes are looking for three. He's got two in his back pocket. Dangerous player now. Stopped by the goaltender. Oh, wow. Stops again. Doesn't lose his focus as he makes a couple of quick ones in a row. Comes up with a stop. Moves it over to Danano. Taken by Eiffel. Cuts to the front with the stop. 
Puck scooped up by Cooley. Here's a shot. Fantastic stick save by Leonard. Nice move by the goalie to get out close to the shooter. Puck set across the blue line. And he makes a save on that play. Puck battle along the boards. And it's freed up over to his teammate with a nice kick pass. Slides it across. Oh, so close on that. Slides it back to the blue line. No penalty called on Chicago. It was clean. Chicago's on the attack. Picked up along the boards by Eichel. Now he takes it over the line. The Blackhawks get a hold of the puck in their own end. Quick feed to Bornstrom. Poked away and forces the turnover at center. Blocked in traffic. Chicago's got the puck along the boards. Lafferty's carrying it ahead. Second period nearly in the books here. Last minute to second. Chicago's got it in the neutral zone. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. And makes the save. Great pressure on the offensive end by Carpenter. And that one's turned away. Now he takes it over the line. Shot. Pass block. The, transition game. the Golden Knights gain possession along the wall. And he makes the easy save. Well, two periods down and one more still to come. Third period action right after we get a clean sheet of ice. So it's now 3-1. Will the Knights take it back? Find out after the message. One more period to go. Will the Knights have it all to come back in? Or will the Blackhawks win it all? to Pacioretty. Across the point. Standing tall with the save. Kubelik's got it in the defensive end. Takes the return feed. Pokes it away in his own end. Nice feed from the right wing. Here he is in close. Long jam in front. That's broken up. Pass to DeHaan. Feeds the puck over to Kubalik. And now he moves it to Strom. Shot! That's blocked by Leonard. And as he opts to freeze the puck, we get a whistle. Starting to look like a little bit of a fire drill in the zone, but this is a good play. Jake Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early 27 at 30. They're getting a little bit close out there. Lead as they have dominated for the most part in this. Back underway as he wins the try inside the offensive zone. Oh, a stick save for the beauty. These are frustrating. You don't get many chances like this. I thought he made a good shot, but the goalie, an excellent stop, beats the shooter. Smith's got it against the boards. And a bad pass, and they'll be forced to start all over again outside the offensive end. Puck grabbed by Petrangelo. Battle along the boards. Puck picked up by Petrangelo. Here's a short pass to Smith. Smith pass puck too too much. He comes in on a breakaway. Stays with it for the save. He was all over this deep. A nice move, but the goaltender is right on it. The centers will glide into the dot. Play results as they win the draw. Oh, knocked it down. Vegas has it in the defensive end. Stays with it. Moves it quickly over to Debrinkit. The Golden Knights get a hold of it. Vegas plays the puck along the boards. Scooped up along the wall by McNabb. Chicago's got the puck in their own end. Great defensive stick work on the play. The Blackhawks gain control of the puck. Sends it over to Lafferty. And that play's broken up. They've got numbers. It's a two-on-one. And now he angles it across to Theodore. They score! Well, this could be something that changes your year around. You get a few bounces like this, or you don't get a few bounces like this. My 
Shots on goal for Chicago and 24 Golden Knights. And they'll be forced to regroup as the puck escapes the offensive end. Grabbed along the board by Theodore. And they won't connect on that one. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. Puts it on net. Pad save. He's on it tonight. Uses the boards with the bank pass. Vegas on the attack. Quick feed to Pacioretty. Turned aside with a glove by Fleury. Didn't, I didn't get the backhand side. one. I'm sorry. The Golden Knights gain possession. And that's stolen by Lafferty. The Golden Knights have it from their own end. Moves it to the offensive zone. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Take possession in the defensive end. Vegas gets a hold of it. Moves it to Pacioretty. Puck scooped up by Kubali. Gains the zone on the left wing. Great use of the stick in the defensive end by Coughlin. Denies that opportunity. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. Here's a shot! And that's broken up. Flurry's gonna smother it to get a whistle. Can get dangerous if nobody's in control of the puck. Inching closer to the midway mark of the period. Just one goal separating these two teams as we sit with a 3-2 lead. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. Take it along the wall by Kane. The Golden Knights get a hold of the puck along the boards. Looks to make a play over to Kane. Cuts to the paint. through center they go on the attack here's the chance that's kicked away with the pad by Fleury with possession along the wall and they'll be forced to tag up after that missed pass quick pass to Martinez he's got a step Chicago's got a hold of it against the wall and now they look to make something happen from the neutral zone. Let's it go! What a clutch save by Leonard! Slides the puck over to Smith. The Golden Knights move it in. Here's a chance right in the slot! Stop. Ooh, that was very close. It was in the blue, but they didn't get to the red line. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. Gets in front of it. You don't even need to look up at that $10 million scoreboard to see that the game is close. You can feel it, James. The pressure is on the players to make the right play in a game that has very little margin. Here's a shot. Oh, what a big time stop by Fleury. Wow. Mark Fleur to Fleury Jones can just keeps going. Defense to offense when he intercepts passes. That's his quick pick zone ability, and he's known for turning the play around for a squad. Chicago's got a hold of the puck. Here's a short pass to Debrinkit. Chicago's got the puck along the wall. Stopped by the goaltender. Oh, there's one more! He really gets a lot of torque on that snapshot. Leans into this shot and forces the goalie to be sharp as he's moving while he shoots it. Scores! Right on the doorstep! He passes on the rebound and puts it home! Blackhawks 
Bucks with a back-breaking goal here in this third period, now up by a pair. They played a terrific hockey game, and when they Chicago go, goal. His first goal of the season, score by number 32, Taj Schertstein. Assisted by number 4, Tom Kiljos, and by number 35, Long Emmett. Time of the goal, 7.15 left to go in the third. Put your foot down on the opponent. So nice, they snug twice. The Blackhawks 
Bucks have put in a complete team effort tonight, but they really look good offensively. Their arms are going to be tired from all the time they've had. Chicago goal is first goal of the season. Score by number, by number 14, Dylan Stroh. That night gets worse here. I think this is a frustration penalty. This night can't end quick enough. This will be now be Chicago power play. The Blackhawks will go to work here in the offensive zone. And the shot dies in the traffic jam. And he regains control of the puck. Here's a short pass to Howden. And they'll be forced to regroup as the puck escapes the offensive end. The Blackhawks have it against the wall. Moves the puck across to Doc. Takes a feed at the point. Takes that one right in the logo. Can't get it to go. There's the horn, and that's the hockey game. The Blackhawks win a dominant victory tonight and really didn't need a whole lot of puck possession either. Lots of times when they play well, they have the puck a lot tonight. They didn't. Yet it still didn't matter because they, they threw up a big number on the board offensively. For Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski. Thanks for joining us tonight. So the final game has been complete. It was a frustration for the last game. Just like the first game of Lightnings and Canadians in the first game of the season. There was 1-0. But the last game turned out to be the same thing. The final score... Blackhawks win 5-2. Now it's time to present your three star players of the game. Starting off with number three, we have is Seth Jones. Three ones on goals, hits, assists, and hits. Second star, Patrick Kane. Two goals and one assist. Turned out to be just like that. With the puck on a string. But... The first star that turned out to be the best was Fleury, 39 saves. Marc-Andre Fleury would have been appreciated if he would have been playing with the Vegas team. But his season turned to be changing different to go with the Blackhawks. So, thank you totally for watching for this video of the game. 48 shots on goal for Chicago and 41 for Vegas. 17 hits for Chicago and 12 for Vegas. 5-4-54 five five, time attack, Chicago, and 10-28 on attack. 92 percentage, looking good and comfortable, but Vegas didn't seem that the passing wasn't great enough. 30 face-off wins for Chicago. It was too many, and they already have killed them. And four face-off wins here for the Knights. And only two minutes here for Chicago, eight minutes here for the Knights, penalty minutes. Two out of four power plays for Chicago and nothing for the Vegas. And 345 was Chicago, along with two minutes here for Vegas Golden Knights. Just two. So that I am done right now. Join us later for the wild card position in between the, the bottom two line. And we will have more on that when we get there close. So that is it. Son of Beast is out. Peace out, everyone. For as a while as the NHL 22 dial and a regular season of the game dial. See you folks next time.